From the 1011 Now Streaming Studio, this is 1011's Morning Pulse. Good morning, I'm Danielle Shank with your Morning Pulse for Friday, April 12th, 2024. 28-year-old Joshua Martin has been missing since last Friday, and now Lincoln police are once again asking for your help to find him. Martin was last seen near 15th and South Streets. He's 5'11", with brown hair and eyes, wearing a red shirt and black shorts with a gray stripe. If you have any information on his whereabouts, please contact LPD at 402-441-6000. To the state legislature, where dozens of bills have been passed and are now heading to the governor's desk. Among them is Omaha Senator Justin Wayne's priority bill, aiming to eliminate the two year waiting period for felons to regain their voting rights. If the governor signs it, individuals will immediately have their voting rights restored once they complete their felony sentence and parole. Another bill put up by Senator Tom Brewer would allow certain school districts to arm staff members. A compromise kept the bill from impacting the largest school districts like those in Omaha and Lincoln. Senator Brewer says this allows smaller, more remote schools without easy access to law enforcement to have a means of protecting the school if necessary. Speaking of schools and teachers, the State Department of Education is launching a teacher apprenticeship program to tackle the teacher shortage. A bill in the legislature last year allocated $1 million toward developing a program to prepare future educators. Yesterday, the first seven apprentices entering the program were signed in and they'll begin training this summer. Nebraska is joining 12 other states in a lawsuit against the Biden administration. Attorney General Mike Hilger says it's about defending ethanol use in Nebraska, claiming the administration is overstating the efficiency of electric vehicles. This comes after a recent announcement changing climate regulations to limit tailpipe emissions. Lastly, who couldn't use some good news on this Friday? Several of you shared with us what's making you smile this week. So starting in the actress with Cher. She is sharing this picture of geese on the water around sunrise. Then Tammy says, I get to babysit my grandson. No better way to spend a Friday. Steph submitting this photo with the caption, some of the best kind of love is grandma's love. Back to nature though, with a corn snake laying 15 eggs. This is from Anna. Lastly, Desiree says she loves the white flower trees that come out around this time. Share what's making you smile on our website. Just click the drop down menu and click on submit photos and videos tab. Rounding out your headlines is a check of the seven day forecast. You've been listening to 1011's Morning Pulse. Watch, listen, stream on the 1011 Now app on YouTube or wherever you get your podcasts.